Oh, all righty. Well, good evening, everybody. Well, um, you know, kind of a little bit of a story on this. Um, I just picked up a game called Garu, Mark of the Wolves. Um, I was watching, um, there was a, a Fatal Fury retrospective video that I started watching. Now, I've heard a lot about, a lot of good things about this game, but it, the, the name never really rung a bell with me. But, like I said, when I, when I started watching this, uh, Fatal Fury retrospective video, um, uh, apparently Mark of the Wolves was, uh, was on the tail end of it. So, which kind of came as a bit of a surprise, so immediately I went ahead and downloaded the game, and, um, at least as of right now, it works. But I've got a feeling that it's gonna crash on my computer. Those that know me know that, uh, my computer is about as stable as nitroglycerin. Like, um, uh, Playing game, playing games on here, it's really hit or miss. Either they work or they don't. But like I said, at least as of the moment, as of this moment, it works. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, I'm gonna go ahead and give this game a quickie run, um, just to see how it plays and stuff. But like I said, this um, this game is uh based on the uh, on the Fatal Fury franchise or Fatal Fury series. Um, I think I remember uh, when I was uh, I was probably probably in the early 90s, I think I was a bag boy working at, working at a grocery store called Homeland in Tulsa, Oklahoma. And um, in their uh, Neo Geo machine they had, uh, Fatal Fury, the very first one, was there and I used to play the crap out of it. So, see, so yeah, I did, and then um, I think I played some of the, uh, some of the second one, Fatal Fury 2. Um, I played a little bit of that, not a whole lot of it. But, yeah, so, but anyway, um, uh, quick recap, um, Garo, Mark of the Wolves, I've heard a lot of stuff about it, most of it positive, but didn't really sink in until I watched this retrospective video and this came up. So, once I saw this, I immediately, uh, got it, downloaded it, and like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and give her a go. And, um, one drawback to this game I definitely see, and you're hearing it right now, or actually, you're not hearing it. It's, uh, you can't, all the, uh, the games and the music and sound effects, you, they, um, everything shuts off when you leave the game window. But on the upside, unlike most other games, hell, unlike most, uh, modern games, you can, um, in this area, you can actually adjust the, uh, you can adjust the game window. Like, you can resize it and everything. Like, I, uh, you don't have, you're not forced into using specific resolutions or anything like like 1280 by 720 which means the very bottom part of the uh, screen is going to be blocked off by my taskbar you know that kind of thing you can you can actually you can uh, custom fit this you can make a custom fit my screen so that's a huge plus right there so not many not many other games i can think of where you can do that but like i said even uh even the most even most modern day games you can't do that it's like fixed resolutions. Like, you can't resize the window. But, anyway. Um, oh, and for those that don't know, Fatal Fury is a it's a type of fighting game. A uh, 2D fighting game. But, yeah. Don Juan. Otaru? That's an actual, uh... I think that's the name of a demon, if I'm guessing right. <laughs> but... Hoku tomorrow. Oh, and I... I did catch a little part of this. These are all, um... All these characters... Are supposed to be based... On the original Fatal Fury characters, so... Street Fighter 3 kind of did the same thing as well. They basically revamped the whole roster. All the characters are now just... They're just different versions of uh, original characters, so... I don't know what Rock is. Dong Wan, I don't know. <laughs> but... Any Tizok? 
Bijane. Okay, she was uh she was off of King of Fighters. Gato. Name sounds familiar. Um Jay Hoon? Um Oh god. Taekwondo fighter. Hata! 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 Oh, I wish I knew his name. Tim Capchuan. Yeah. That's probably him. Terry Bogard. Okay. That's an all-time classic right there. He was he's been around since the very first Fatal Fury. Um. And I don't think this game has a random select. So let's. Let's pick him. Oh, I can just pick my opponent. So we have light, okay, um, okay, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need to switch the buttons on this, so I don't know if you can do it on here or not. Hey, Neo Geo. Just defended. Yeah, I gotta switch to the menu. So. Let's try it again, but yeah, it. Grant. Kane. Oh, so we got more. So. So why am I on? Um... I'm guessing these are boss characters. Hey, come on, come on. Okay, so we have back dash. I'm hitting, um... <laughs> so you're supposed to do other stuff when hitting, um, multiple buttons. I 
I don't know what a TLP is. Ew, uppercut motion. Nope. So I'm guessing this game doesn't have negative edge where Where's uh down where I'm doing down forward and punch. You could also hold down the button. Hold the, yeah, hold down the button, do the motion and then release, but I guess this game doesn't have it. So I'm gonna see if I can uh no, I don't want to quit the game. So, I'm going to look for something that at least resembles a grappler. I guess t -Zock. I'm guessing he doesn't have a 360 pile driver. At least that's what I'm guessing. Cry hug, Griffin Tower. Okay. Okay, I don't get that one. Oh yeah, that takes some timing. Yeah, that takes some timing. Yeah, that takes some timing. All right, so let's see. What... Whoop, wrong one, wrong one. know what a T.O.P. is. Oh, got it. It's, it's got it. We are... It's got it. So, I can't do a 360 with an analog stick. I can only do it with a D-pad. Yeah. No. Okay, so, the way it's looking now is, uh, You technically don't have to do a full 360 in order to do the move. You can actually do a 270 degree, like uh, forward, down, to back, to up, and then hit the attack and hit punch. Yeah. So yeah, oh, I'm a grappler. Um.
Alright, Tiz, where you at? Oh, yeah. I'm just gonna... Um... No? Okay. So I guess that's two player only. <laughs> but <laughs> Okay, but um I'm just gonna do a match or two of this And then call it good Like I said, this is just a quickie demo like King of Fighters, there's short hops on this. <laughs> well, we got button reading. We got button reading. Doesn't show the move list. Rock hard <laughs> style martial arts. There it is. Go back. Um, the hell is a BR? BR, D version, BR. Breaking move. Canceled by... Well, that kind of helps. Maybe I should have spent a little bit more time in training mode, but like I said, this is, this is just a demo. So... Oh, 
Almost had it. Yeah, probably gonna lose this one. Round two. The T.O.P. that I was talking about, if you look at their health bars, um, I got the bright white right in the middle of that bar. That's your, um, when your health gets to about that range, that's when you can do your T.O.P. move, which I believe... Yeah. Throw didn't go off. Fuck. Fuck. Gotta pause, gotta pause, gotta pause. Small kitchen. Off the kitchen, there's a one. I hit some I hit something on my controller that causes uh the stuff I had on my uh, YouTube YouTube window to play. So I had a Eliminate that. Yeah, uh, so far, so far I kind of like it, um, and at least as of this moment, it didn't crash, so there could be a chance that I might actually be streaming this game in the future, but then, um, that's kind of the next test there too, um, I mean, if I, if I stream the game and like absolutely nobody comes on it, then it's really not worth it. Most I might do would be like a quickie gameplay run or something like that, but... And plus, uh, I think most... I'm probably one of very few people in my community or around my neck of the woods that gets into fighting games. Most everybody else... Nope. So... But, well... But I'll probably at least try to stream this game at least once. And then see how that goes. So... But, yeah. Once again, though, um, I kind of like it. But I don't, not very pad friendly, but I think most most fighting games that I've played aren't really pad friendly to begin with. It's like you almost you almost need a you need a arcade stick, but you but yeah. So but anyway, um thanks for watching everybody though. Um I appreciate that and uh I'll see you all next time.